Well, in the hit film 2012, the entire planet starts falling to pieces and actually shifts poles after the planet's core starts going south. So you can imagine it got our attention when NASA said the catastrophic earthquake in Chile was so powerful, it knocked the Earth off of its axis and shortened the length of the day. My guest is author of Physics of the Impossible. Michi Okaku is a professor of physics and host of the sci-fi science, of sci-fi science on the Science Channel. And graduated first in his physics class at Harvard. I mean, what more could you ask for? All right, Michio. This, I, I'm not that into science. I mean, honestly, I've got to be honest with you. But it knocked the Earth off its axis. Even that got my attention. Well, first of all, no one's going to fall off the Earth. Uh, you're not going to get a shorter work week. However, the Earth did shift three inches off its axis, and the day was actually shortened by 1.26 microseconds. How? So this was a colossal earthquake. Remember that the Earth shifted six feet over a distance of several hundred miles, 20 miles underneath the ground. It's like a skater bringing in her arms at the Olympics. You spin faster and faster. The Earth actually contracted. Look what we have ready to go as you talk to us about skaters. Right. Nancy so you, Kerrigan, she's doing the same thing the earthquake did. But right. how? Okay, how? Explain to me how that move right there is okay. like the earthquake. Okay, as she brings in her arms, it's like the crust of the earth contracting as one plate went under another plate. So several hundred miles of plate six, shifted six feet in the earth, and that increased the rotational speed because the Earth contracted slightly. Right. So what does it mean for us? I mean, are we going to sort of be walking around tilted to the left now or what? <laughs> no. It's a very tiny effect. And, however, GPS systems could eventually be affected. It's a cumulative effect. The Earth is permanently slightly off axis now. Really? And what about the shortening of time? How does it shorten the day by a couple of seconds? Well, instead of going 24 plus or minus uh, hours in a day, it's off by 1.26 microseconds. It's a very tiny effect, but it builds up over time. Time. So like the GPS system, telecommunications, or space satellites, will eventually have to take this into consideration. That but for you and me, it's not going to affect our daily life. It's so incredible, though, to think. I mean, if you want to respect Mother Nature, you look at something like this and you really do. Mm -hmm. Michio Kaku, it's a pleasure having you. Right. How about that? So if you had a bad day last week, you got a little shorter. I don't, does, is today a little shorter, too, or was it just that one day? Oh, no, forever. Forevermore. Right. Well, there you have it. Michio Kaku, thank you.